Hey there. Welcome. This is Miguel Martinez Juarez. And today I want to talk about mindset, okay? To help you get in shape. You can also apply this to other things, okay? You can apply it to um, getting APA or a master's degree, starting a business, right? I'm working on starting a business right now. I'm going to start it. It's going to happen, right? Like to be fully running, okay? AP without me. <laughs> yes. Okay, so now, mindset. Here are the one, two, three, four, five things you need that will create results, okay? Okay? That's decision. The decision that you're going to get it done no matter what. This creates your belief system. Because you said, okay, I'm going to do it. I'm going to get it done. I'm going to get it done. No matter what. Yeah, sometimes it's a little scary, but you got to do it. Even just me saying that, no matter what, it means like I got to do it no matter what. Because I'm putting myself out there. I'm telling myself I got to do it, right? So now, that's one. That's decision. That's what you need for your mindset. Two is discipline. You need discipline. Right? Set rules. What's the first thing you're going to do when you get up? Right? What's up, Mike? I'm talking about mindset to get in shape and also get results in other areas in your life as well because you can use this too. Right? So you need discipline. You need to have rules for yourself. When are you going to work out? Every morning, Monday through Friday. Right? You can do that. Set it down as a rule and get it done. I do it every single morning. The first thing that I do, um, well, the first thing I do is shower, clean up, then meditate, look over my goals, write 10 things that I'm grateful for to set my vibration on point so I'm happy and grateful to be alive, grateful for the day. See, I'm smiling now because I'm grateful for all of this. Um, grateful to be here on Facebook and talking to you. So that's what I do. Then I go to the gym. Right after I do that, I go to the gym, I do my facet cardio without eating, um, and I have a, a little drink that has branching amino acids, my pre-workout, and my multivitamin, all mixed inside natural, organic, right? So I'm sipping on that, and then I do my facet cardio, right? Now I'm doing my, my workouts at night, right? That's mandatory. The beginning of the day and the end of the night, I'm working out. But through in the, in the day, I'm training. That's my rule that's what i'm disciplined to do sometimes i don't want to do it sometimes i'm just like oh my body doesn't want to walk it <laughs> doesn't want to do the work but by the time i'm done i'm so grateful i'm so happy that i completed the job and for me it's more a habit now for me it's habit now because i love training i love training um but i've created a habit we're also trying to break habits okay that's what the discipline helps after you d- your discipline for a certain amount of time it's a habit, and you don't even need the discipline because it's just second nature. You've created a, a habit. Now, you got to be persistent. You got to keep doing it no matter what. You know, like, if you don't get it done in the amount of time that you said you were going to do it, it's okay. Learn from it. Get the job done. Okay? Learn from it. Do something different. Get the job done. Okay? That's persistence. Now, you must have patience. 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 Do not be in a rush to get the thing done. There's a difference between being rushed and having urgency. I've read this before somewhere, but it's a difference. Rushing is you're you're hectic. You're going all over the place, like ah, right? Um, that's funny. I can't, I make noises. I realize I make noises uh, like to make things more animated. But you need to have patience. Be urgent, right? When opportunity when opportunity comes. Grab it, jump on it. But you don't want to be in a hurry. That's how accidents happen. That's how car crashes happen. That's how I've scratched my car, actually. Being in a, in a hurry, rushing, okay? Um, so there's a difference. Be urgent for your success. Be urgent in getting you those opportunities. But don't rush, okay? This means be patient, and as you do this, you will get results, okay? You will get results. But this is all mental faculties, decision, discipline, persistence, patience, willpower. These are all ideas. These are all concepts, right, that you already have in here that you can understand and apply. 
okay? That is the mindset. I want you to have that mindset, okay? Have decision. Once you decide you're going to do it no matter what, that's your belief system. You believe you're going to do it, right? You believe you're going to do it, okay? So I want you to believe. Start with number one, decision. Then create systems and be disciplined. Be disciplined. Be persistent. Never give up. You will get there, right? You will get there. I recommend you read um, the chapter on persistence in um, Napoleon Hill's Think and Grow Rich. It's a great chapter. I've like... I don't think I did it for 30 days, but I did it for a long time where I was listening to it every morning, every morning. Persistence, persistence. Okay, and willpower. You must have willpower. If you say you're going to eat 1,700 calories or 1,400 calories, <laughs> um, I don't recommend you go to 14. That just depends on who you are, right? Your body height and your metabolic rate. Willpower. Make sure you hit that number. Make sure you don't go above it, okay? Stick to the plan. Use the, your will. Okay? So this is the mindset. This is what I want to talk about to you today so that you have an understanding of what's going on um, before you create your results in fitness or in any other area in, in your life. Okay? You must you must say it no matter what. What's up, Jose? How you doing, my man? So I'm talking about mindset to get in shape. And to succeed in other areas in life as well. How you doing, Jose? Oh man, let me know if you have any questions. I'm here to solve, to help you solve them. Because you got to do it. You got to solve it. I can show you the way. Oh, you you want to come in? 